Welcome to the channel everybody and thank you so much for joining me. Today we are playing RimWorld. This is our biotech update and we are on episode number 14. Now if you hadn't joined us recently you would uh, kind of notice the population has exploded here at the colony. We've got Webster, Boo, they're both new, Slick is new, um, and I hope we have enough beds for everybody. Actually, I think we have almost the perfect amount. We've got this one open one here, uh, which is good because I was thinking I might have to move some stuff around in this place. I might finally have to deconstruct these and move them over to our, our true laboratory spot. But anyway, we've got quite a full group. I need to look at weapons here. Look at this. We've picked up a poor charge lance. I'll probably end up selling that. But uh, Oh, we got a sculpture already. Nice. Good job. This is uh, from our good pal D.D. Dietrich. So let's slap this down. I think this room is still not quite up to where I'd like it to be. Well, right now it says awful. It's because it's covered in dirt. We should have some cleaning happening. I hope that uh, hope some people don't neglect that. It's on their tasks. Uh, well, we'll see what happens. I might have to set some people's job to just strictly cleaning, nothing else. Okay, we're doing a little bit of hunting up here. Kind of close to the edge of the map, but uh, the game is kind of sparse right now. Uh-oh. What do we got here? Ooh, some visitors. I tell you, this playthrough, the visitors here have been great for trading. Let's get Saku over here to trade with those folks. Yeah, we've been really, really getting successful with those uh, visitor trades. That's how we managed to get both our barrels for the mortars here, was through visitor trades, if you can believe that. But uh, pretty sweet. All right, Boo, what is Boo doing? Boo is still asleep, man. Boo is our production specialist. She was promoted last episode. And so I'm really excited to get her going. Okay, so we can sell. Hmm. I'm going to sell three of the tox grenades. We'll keep one of them. And we're also going to keep our... Molotov. Probably gonna sell all this stuff though. We did buy that flame bow, so I'm taking kind of a loss, but I'm realizing now that we have uh, our production specialist, I don't need it. Same with this bolt action. Probably don't need to keep that around anymore. All right. Ooh, you know what? We got to buy this tea. I'm so glad I noticed that and remembered it last episode. Uh, Larson went on a binge and drank all the tea we had left. So we have a waster in the colony. They're going to require some sort of psychite. So we're buying all that. 100%. I'd just like to get this up over positive. Ah, well. Good enough. Good enough. Let's move on. See what we got here. Oh, a gene pack nonviolent, a small capsule containing a package of genetic information. Okay, okay, so well, we're not at that point, and I don't think we'd really want one for nonviolent anyway. Now the honor is good, but one single glitter world? What? What? I'm almost more tempted by the hyperweave, honestly. I'm not even going to do this one. Toxic Cloud, I'm not into it. <laughs> I hate Toxic uh, toxic Fallout. I really, truly do. Especially when you got animals and a farm and stuff. So we're just going to pass on that. The rewards weren't that great, were they? I didn't think so. Yeah, man, somebody is falling behind on the dang cleaning. I'll tell you that. Look at this room. It's just pitiful. I think maybe we should restrict some of these dogs. Or, I'm sorry, keep calling them dogs. They are wolves. We'll put the puppies should be in the yard. Yep, okay, what's this? Oh boy. Two prisoners, 17 days. 41 millitors times two. Jesus. Now that we would definitely end up doing a little hand-to-hand -hand combat on, wouldn't it? 41 Militors times 2? <laughs> I, I don't think so. We're not going to invite destruction. What does Randy think we're made of right now? Our wealth must be skyrocketing. Oh my gosh. Yeah, well, it's getting too high. I probably built these 
buildings a little prematurely. I have a feeling that's adding to wealth. And of course, we did pick up several new colonists, so that's going to send us higher. But we just we just got to make up for it. I need Boo to go ahead and... Oh, she's cutting stone chunks. Okay, not good. Let's get her started immediately making some clothing, please, Boo. Not just for yourself, but for the rest of the group. This is going to help get her uh, skills up a little bit. Mm, we'll go ahead and make several hats. We can trade those. And they don't take very long at all. Where are you at, Boo? What are you doing? Okay, now she's coming over. Cool, cool. We got some muffalo wool. I'm almost tempted to get a breeding pair of these muffalo because that's nice. But how's the food tolerance in here? Yeah, see, nutrition consumption even right now is a little too high for this this area. It looks big, but it's pretty it's pretty rocky. There's a lot of crappy terrain in this spot. Hmm, no worries. We got plenty of kibble. So let's see. Oh boy. Well, Webster just went berserk. Yeah, that's not good. Let me look at this guy. Why he because he ate meat is what it says. Um, so we should have arrested him already. I kind of forgot about his ideology being different, which is a blunder. Um, let's get, uh, I don't want to kill him, obviously. We, he's unarmed, so he's just like a prisoner gone wild. If we just get, uh, get the crew out here. I'm not going to call Larson. He's, he's, he's a cripple. He is a cripple. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I don't want the lifters coming out here, guys. Come back, come back. Oh, Christ, there's Larson right there. Holy shit. Wait, is Webster going for him? No, oh, look, Webster's attacking the squirrel. <laughs> I thought Webster was going to make a beeline right for Larson. Nope, he's going for the squirrel. Well, that's kind of nice, actually. All right, Larson, go about your duties, sir. Um, hopefully our crew can get out here first. Get the lifter. Do your thing, lift. Nope. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Actually, hold hold off. Let's get everybody together. Gee, I don't want them shooting, but... I love how Webster's just taking out animals. That's hilarious to me. He's a little beat up, too, so that's kind of helpful to us. Get out of here, Dietrich. Let's go, buddy. Yeah, focus on... No, don't hit... Oh, thank God. All right, just a bruise. Ooh okay okay our doctor is on a mental break right now so i think dungus is the next best yeah pretty sure r r wait whoa, whoa 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 slick what about you oh never mind slick is the best all right go slick go we're happy about that poor little guinea pig how's your health yeah you'll be fine we'll hunt you and kill you to put you out of your misery all right we're fine everything's going good uh, we are just looking for steel and components, really. <laughs> Please ignore all the carnage and mayhem. It's just all about steel and components. Okay, so we've arrested Webster, and we, the conversion will begin. Shouldn't take, hopefully it won't take too long. Let me look at him. He's not iron-willed, is he? Mm, no. Uh, so hopefully this won't take too long. Hmm. I tell you, I prefer the... EMP grenades over the EMP launcher. So I would go for this right now, but for one thing, I don't know if we can quite afford it. I'd probably have to sell off some of my high explosive shells, which isn't a bad idea, actually, because that will allow us to afford a little bit, and we can always make more. We've got the chem fuel for it now, so yeah, because um, right now we don't have the tech to build an SMG, so I'm going to grab one of those. And I'd also really like to get this, just just in case we get a, a get hit by Max. We don't want to be totally caught with our pants down. Um, some smoke would be nice too, but this is what we got, so this is what we're going to go with. And also, God, I'd love to get that low shield pack, but I'm sure we'll have another opportunity for that. So this is a pretty decent trader. Pretty decent. Let's see here. Okay, whoa, 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 Saku, get back here. I want you to carry that in, and Boo, come on out here and grab yourself a new gun, lady. She's going to be getting into gun production eventually. We just don't have the components for it, and we don't really have the high enough research yet. So buying that SMG was pretty 
pretty good, pretty good. Now we just need a decent gun for Larson. Poor guy. Oh boy, check it out. Well, well, well. Slick and Saku are lovers. Well, that makes sense because Saku is a high mate. So, wow. Now, Slick is a little bit on the older side. I was, I think, wondering last episode, is she still viable? Can she still have kids? Well, we're going to find out. And um, <laughs> Saku is quite a young man. He is 19. And Slick is, well, let's get them a bed. We need to get them a bed ASAP. Furniture, double bed, wooden, sounds good to me. We'll just plop that down right there. I will go ahead and give them their own end table because I'm a nice ruler. Yes, yes, uh, very good. Okay, so it's, I've got my Constructoids uh, in group one here. Oh, I'm sorry, no, group two with the Militors so that they went dormant because we didn't have anything for them to do. So really, if I want them up and running, it's uh, just as easy as assigning them to group two real quick. Or I'm sorry, group one. I keep getting them mixed up, but yeah, just assign them to the other group. Now, while they're up and running, I was kind of wanting to get this thing tiled over or at least put something in here. Right now, the floor or the material I have the most of is uh, marble, so... I just want to go with something cheap, but yeah, marble's the best. All right, can add some serious beauty here, but uh, uh, I mean, it will add some serious wealth probably. I just don't want to do wood floors. Wood floors are terrible. Hmm. I don't know. I'll figure something out. Oh my God! Webster just went berserk again inside the prison cell because he killed that squirrel. <laughs> This guy, he's something else. Oh my god, no way. Jeez, no wonder he went berserk. Look at his negative. Wow, whatever I this animalistic ideology he has is terrible. It does not uh, combat with ours at all. Wow, okay. And we also got a mechanoid cluster at the same time. Isn't that just the funnest thing in the whole world ever? Okay, well, um, hmm. I think I'm just going to delete the zone real quick. Yeah, I don't want anybody going out there for that. Mm, wow. Okay, hold on. Where are you going, lifter? Okay, you're going to grab that steel. Ooh. We got ourselves a centipede and a, oh, a militor. Hello. This right here, I love to see how far away that is from everything else. We might actually get that captured. I don't know. We're going to see. Th these guys might take care of this for us. Oh, look. They're well equipped for it, too. They get themselves an EMP launcher, too. We'll see what how this goes. Um, I am. Where are you going, Saku? Ooh, you really need to go down there to get that? Damn. Okay, that's fine. I am going to watch these, my people, real closely. I don't want anybody stumbling into this. Oh, look, countdown activator in half an hour. Okay. Well, we're going to have to take this thing on, then. I can tell already. Larson, where you at, buddy? Where is that EMP launcher? Guess what? You, be, you just became our EMP guy. Okay, where are these guys going? Ugh. All right, we are... We're going to cancel this. We're just holding off on stuff real quick. I'm just trying to avoid these guys going outside for right now. I want to see what happens with this before we start making any real combat plans. Oh, there it goes. What's up? Maybe they'll start keying in on my little aggro hand here and come right in. I don't know. Looks like they're just going to meander. That's okay. Oh, look. Here we go. Ha <laughs> ha. I love it. Yeah. Come on, Malone. Bro, what are you shooting at? Hit the centipede. Oh, he's dead. Well, I'm so glad we just bought our EMP launcher, huh? Oh, these guys are going to get themselves murdered. Hmm. Hmm. Look at the little Militor. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I am super tempted now. Because these guys are going to lose this fight. I can tell that already. Um, now might be the time to just 
dive out there and do this. All right, let's get everybody up. I mean, at the very least, I'm going to throw my Militors out there. Why can't I get a... Oh, I got to get... Yeah, I got to get Larson up here, too. All right, let's bring the group out. I don't want to get them too far from the doors here. If we can just knock out that centipede with our EMP, I'm going to feel real good about the situation. All right, let's send our little Militors out there. Come on, guys. Move closer. What's the range on Larson? Oh, crap. I can't see the range without my mod. Darn it. Um, hold on. Maybe I can. Yeah, I can. Okay. Oh, no. They're triggered. Oh. All right. Get up here. Yeah, they're not quite in range. Oh, the damn boo just got hit. Something spread out a little bit. Move up. Move up. Oh, come on, Larson. Hit that thing. <gasps> oh, you're a little too... You're flanking a little too hard there, Slick. Oh, God, you're exposing yourself even more. He is aiming for Dungus. Dungus, take cover, bro. Okay, Slick, are you better? Yes, get, just stand right there, Slick. I can't believe Larson is such a terrible shot with that thing. Maybe we should move him a little closer. Uh, how you doing, Slick? You got some burns, boo. Ooh, boo, you took a bad shot. Oh, <laughs> that scared me. I thought that was a pawn for a second. I was like, no. All right, we're good, we're good. We can always recharge the Militors. Um, let's see here. So these guys, oof, they're pretty much dead, aren't they? Oh, come on with that EMP, bro. There's no cover out here except maybe this tree. He's oh, he's he's keyed on Larson, I can tell. Yeah, shoot. God, these centipedes are so... Oh, thank God. Alright, Larson, go. Go, go. Dungus, you go too. Alright, we'll take that. No, 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 no. <laughs> I'm gonna lay down right there, don't they? Oh, Dietrich, I forgot all about you, buddy. Well, good job. You held up the fort there. Grab that little guy, please. Fire shouldn't affect any of this stuff, I don't think. Um, we've still got the turrets up. I'm going to leave those. Uh, yeah, we'll come back when we're in better shape. We'll take those out, or maybe somebody else will. I don't have to worry too much with that wall right there. I just want to get, get inside before the fire takes everything out. Now, what do we got here? LMGs are garbage. Garbage, garbage. Eh, nothing really worth risking our neck for. Let's just get Dietrich to grab our Militor and we're out. I think I'll go ahead and forbid those anyway. Yeah, we don't want our guys running out here just yet. Not just yet. Now, it's my understanding that the fire won't burn this, but... Oh, maybe it's the fire's burning whatever's underneath it, probably. Okay, guys, get in here. We'll get them repaired up, too. No worries, no worries. That wasn't so bad. Thanks to the help of the uh, trading caravan who got themselves killed. But yeah, not too bad. Oh, no. Bad news. 
Larson's in a mental break, and uh, this guy's about to wander out there. This lifter, I can't, I can't grab him. Uh, luckily, the fire won't hurt him, and there's rain right now, but uh, still not good. Just goes to show you what happens when your mechanator is uh, all messed up and <laughs> goes on a mental break occasionally. Not so good, not so good. Okay, we have snuck up on the little turret here, and we are about to do a little flanking maneuver. I'm going to have my two little Dace robots step right out here, and they will become a target. There we go. And now these guys can come in here. And I don't know. I want them over here, away from this thing, so because I know it's going to explode. I can just feel it in my bones. Oh, nice, nice. We got it. Awesome. Cool. It's too easy. Now this. Oh, yeah. We want that big time. We'll take this too and deconstruct it. Same with that. There might be some components in here. So this is pretty exciting. This is pretty exciting. Uh, Larson, buddy. He's over here standing by the door. So the Militors have somewhere to go. Let's get them over there. Larson, come out here, buddy. And I want you to... Let's get you to... Oh, what? Oh, I thought he was inside and constructing. Never mind. Let's get, get you to haul something, bud. Uh, Dungus. Boo. Oh, yeah. Boo is definitely assigned to it. Install that. Deconstruct that, boo. Whoa, whoa, boo. Get over here. Uninstall. I want all this stuff. We need any components which might be here. Nope, just plasteel. Darn it. No, oh, that's okay. Why don't you go ahead and just deconstruct it? Let's just see what it's made out of. Ah, one component. Very nice. Yeah, we need to get this put, I don't know, somewhere. I'll situate it. Actually, look at this. That might be pretty perfect right there because it's pretty close. That's perfect. Uh, give me the conduit, please. Look at that. Look at that. Even lines up with our previous conduit. Super nice. Okay, we'll have these guys go back into dormancy. I've got my two constructoids in dormant mode because there's not much going on for them right now. I did decide to go ahead and slap down concrete here because it takes steel, but not a lot. You know, not a lot. So it looks a lot nicer. Uh, things are going pretty good, though. Colony is shaping up pretty well. We just handled our second mech cluster. <laughs> And maybe not totally independently, but hey, we got it done. We got it done. Hey, look at that. We got uh, Webster converted already. Nice, buddy. Good. See, now we just release you. See how easy that was? You don't have to freak out and go on Berserk anymore. I mean, what was that about, bro? Why are you going on Berserk constantly? That was weird. Like, this dude's just violent. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. I set these guys to hunt. I should have known better. Uh, well, let's just see. Let's let's back them up a little bit. Dungus is rocking that shotgun. Oh, good shot, Slick. Nice. All right, can they get these guys? Dungus, Slick, can you pick that up, please? Oh, come on now with this. It's all right. We can deal with this. There's ways around this. Oh, don't kill yourself, Dungus. You're getting a little... Oh, hold on. Okay, hold on. Let Slick get through here, please. <laughs> oh, boy. All right, now, are, are you two a little close, buddy? You need to be that close? No, no, stop there. Now fire at the stupid thing. Kind of micromanage these boomaloop hunts. That's what I should have done from the start. I can see why he got closer now. He sucks. Okay, good. It's about to release him and just let this thing die on its own. Hey, we got two boomaloops. Okay, didn't I set a third one? Because now I'm kind of regretting it. <laughs> Let me see here. See, there's not a lot of wildlife out here. Um, We'll kill the guinea pig. I'm just trying to get enough food now. 
Just want to make sure we got plenty of food in the colony. You know how that goes, guys. Well, we have officially run out of time for today. Thank you so much for joining me, everybody. I appreciate you all stopping by and spending time. Come back tomorrow. We're going to have a brand new episode up, and I will see you then.